you know, uh, I think this was maybe five or six years ago. And uh, there's a video on YouTube, I think the title is Competition is for Losers. And uh, I think in 2015 or 2016, uh, Peter Thiel uh, posted that video on, on YouTube. And it's, uh, it's a lecture. It's one of his lectures that he gave at uh, Stanford Business School. Peter basically describes, I mean, uh, he divides the business world into two sets of businesses. Uh, he says that businesses are either businesses that are monopolies or near monopolies, or there are businesses which are in very competitive spaces. And basically, uh, a very small sliver of businesses will end up in you know, these oligopoly or monopoly type situations. And most, most of capitalism is a dog-eat-dog world, and it's very competitive and such. And, and he makes the bold assertion, uh, he's telling his students, basically, there is no point to wasting your time and forming a business or going to work for a business that deals with serious competitive forces. And of course, you know, probably 99% of capitalism is businesses that are very competitive, which have a lot of competition and so on. And maybe 1% or less is, you know, these uh, unusual modes and uh, competitive advantages, which give you, uh, give you some, you know, breathing room, if you will. And um, he, he says that the businesses that are monopolies go through, typically go through some serious uh, lengths to try to convince you that they are not a monopoly. And because, you know, they just don't want the added attention and they don't want regulatory changes or, you know, just uh, people don't like monopolists too much. So they like to be under the radar and uh, at least portray and pretend for the most part that they are not monopolies. And the 99% that are in hyper competitive spaces spend all their time trying to convince you that they actually are monopolies, that they have no competition, that they have great competitive advantages. And look, here's my list of advantages that nobody can touch me on. So, the basically what the businesses are presenting for the most part is backwards. The monopolists just want to tell you, oh, poor me, I'm not a monopoly. I'm just one of many competitive businesses. And the ones which have the loser business models want to try to convince you that, no, no, I'm a very special business and I have these special qualities. 